Good morning, warriors of God, servant of the Lord, Derek Lane. It's that time again, praying for America. I'm always excited to pray for this country. Let's go to the word of God first. Romans chapter 8, verse number 35. The Bible says, can anything ever separate us from Christ's love? Does it mean he had no longer loves us if we have trouble or calamity? or are persecuted, or hungry, or destitute, or in danger, or threatened with death? As the scriptures say, for your sake, we are killed every day. We are being slaughtered like sheep. No, despite all these things, overwhelming victory is ours, through Christ who loved us. Mm -hmm. And I am convinced that nothing can ever separate us from God's love. Neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, mm -hmm. neither our fears for today or our worries about tomorrow. Not even the powers of hell can separate us from God's love. No power in the sky above or in the earth below. Indeed, nothing in all creation will ever be able to separate us from the love of God that is revealed in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Let's pray for America. Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, the anointed one and his anointing, I thank you, Father God, on today. Now, in accordance with your word, in all these things, you have made us to be more than conquerors. I thank you, Father God, that no angels, nor demons, nor death, nor height, Father, can separate us from your love. I thank you, Father God, that in the name of Jesus, despite the troubles, the threats, the persecution, my God, in the name of Jesus, none of these things will be able to separate America from your love. I thank you, Father God, that we, the people, having done all to stand, we are continuing to stand. So, Father God, I come once again as your servant. I am fully armed. I am fully dressed. I put on the armor of light. I put on oh my ikosoko ma'iasata. I put on the armor of God, the helmet of salvation, sword of the spirit, shoe of faith, breastplate of righteousness. My feet are so shy with the preparation of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Mm. And I run and I leap like a deer. I run and I oh my koshorama asati. I run and I leap like a kangaroo on today, for charging like a lion with a sword mm -hmm, into the enemy's camp. And I put a thousand demons to flight today out of America be gone because there is no sickness, no disease, no fear, <laughs> no calamity, nothing, no poverty, no lack. Nothing will be able to separate us from the love of God in this country. Now, Father God, we give you our government. You have permission, heaven. Mm -hmm. Heaven, you have permission. Father God, you have permission. Send, oh God, those fighting force. Have your way in the White House. Send the fighting force of heaven. Have your way in the Supreme Court. Send the fighting force, of oh God, of heaven. Have your way in the Senate and the Congress. God, in Jesus' name, America is God's country. Our nation belongs to you. Created and founded under Christian principles. This is why we can raise our hand and say we are one nation under God. This is what we can always say in America, in the USA, in God we trust, because Jesus is Lord in this country. Father God, bless us today as we go out. Bless us as we come in. May this day be a day where you will send Archangel Gabriel to the United States of America and bring we the people great news from heaven in the name of God, the Father, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, and the Ruach Kadosh, the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. I pray today in Jesus' name. Amen, 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 warriors. Remember this, nothing, 
Nothing that man can do, nothing that woman can do, nothing that man can say, oh my coche, nothing that woman can say, mm, will ever be able to separate us from the love of God Almighty through Christ Jesus our Lord. Go out today, put a thousand demons to flight per person, together we put 10,000 demons to flight. Have yourself a blessed day. Know that God is with you. The angels of God encamp around you. You have divine help. You are covered with the blood of Jesus and know that no devil, just like the scripture says, no devil in hell under the earth shall be able to touch us because of the blood of the lamb. Until the next time, praying for America. Have a great day, warriors. Bye-bye.